Hey everyone, in this video we're going to solve this quadratic equation using the potion low style. So how do you do that? Well the first thing you do is you look at this number here and you need two numbers that add to the opposite of that number. So the opposite of 3 is negative 3. So they have to add to negative 3 always no matter what. And then they have to multiply to whatever number is there. So multiply to 1. I should point out that if you have a number in front of the x squared, like say you have 3x squared plus 6x plus 7 equals 0, then you would just divide everything by 3. So uh, in this problem here, I purposely put a 1 here just to make it a little bit easier. All right, so add to the opposite of this and multiply to this always. Now the answers are always going to be of the form, so here's what you do. You take this and you divide it by 2 and then you put a plus u. That's one of the answers. And then the other answer is negative 3 over 2 minus u. So we have written down the answers to this problem already. So all we have to do is find u. Notice they're being multiplied. That's because they multiply to 1. So you always set it equal to whatever is there. So step 1, as a recap, you need two numbers that add to the opposite of this. Boom, there it is. Then you need multiply to 1. Boom, there it is. And then the next step is to take this number here, the negative 3, divide it by 2, and then just add and subtract u and multiply them together and set it equal to this. Now you can use the difference of squares formula. Remember, if you have a plus b times a minus b, that's going to be a squared minus b squared. So this will be... Um, simply a squared would be 9 fourths, right, because you square the 3, square the 2, and then uh, minus u squared, and that's equal to 1. So now we have to subtract 9 fourths. So if you think of 1 as a number over 4, so maybe 4 over 4. So now we can subtract 9 fourths, subtract 9 fourths, so we end up with negative u squared, equals 4 fourths minus 9 fourths is negative 5 fourths. Okay, multiply by negative 1. Let me scroll down here a little bit. So that's going to give us u squared equals 5 fourths. Now we take the square root of both sides. When you take the square root and you have a variable squared, you're always supposed to put a plus or minus. So this is u equals plus or minus. The square root of 5 is simply the square root of 5 and the square root of 4 is 2. So that's not the answer. We're almost there, right? These are the u's, right? The answers are up here. We wrote them down at the beginning. So it'll be negative 3 halves plus u, negative 3 halves minus u. But we already have a plus or minus here, right? So the final answer is negative 3 halves, or answers, right? There's two of them. Negative 3 halves plus or minus the square root of 5 over 2. And that's how you do it using the method of Poche and Lowe.